Hello everybody, my name is Zachary and welcome back to my channel. Today will be an interesting day because it's starting to get to the point where I need to get a haircut. You know, I recently have been trying to grow in my hairline because I don't know, when I cut my hairline myself, I've been pushing it back too much. And so I've been letting it just grow out. You know, I'm proud of that. Not everyone has, has that. I have a really strange hairline. So I honestly don't like it when I have like a really sharp hairline because two days later, the hairline just doesn't look right because my hairline is just messed up. But as of now, since I have a full head of hair, I am going to enjoy it and see if I can find a barber. Now, this would be my second haircut that I've had in, had in Milan or second haircut I've had in Italy altogether. And the first haircut, I really didn't like it. It's It was like, I think the guy was from maybe Naples or something and he was just, he just gave me a very, a very strong Italian haircut. And I, I need something with a little bit more fade on the side and a little bit more subtle fade on, uh, fade on the side and some hair, or I just keep the hair on the top. As a black man in Italy, it's important to either know how to cut your hair or to find a good barber. Now I know how to cut my hair, but it's really, really hard to cut the back of my hair only because the mirror that I have to put on the, uh, normally on the back of a door so you can see the back of your head. I don't really have anything in my apartment that works like that. So I normally just put it on like the back of this like little thing right here. I put it on there and I just try my best to cut it. I can always make it look perfect on the front, but on the back, no, it never looks good. So I'm kind of tired of doing it this time. And so for this time, I think I'm going to just have someone else do it. Also, please, please like and subscribe to these videos. That helps me so much. And I appreciate you guys. Everyone who subscribes and watches my videos, I'm like, yes, let's go, let's go. Um, please subscribe. Also follow me on Instagram and on TikTok. Also DM me on Instagram if you have like questions about um, Italy, life in Italy, life in Milan, life as a design student, all those different questions. Please let me know. Sometimes in the comments on YouTube, I don't always see them right away, but if you uh, DM me on Instagram, I'll see them more fast, faster. I'll see them faster. I was a little concerned when he was washing my hair before the cut because I don't know if he realized how black hair reacts to water, but I didn't want to interrupt his process, so I let the man work his magic, do what he needed to do. But the look on his face after washing my hair and seeing my hair was hilarious. I really wasn't trying to crack up with this, but I think they wanted, I think they thought I wanted my hair like super flat, but I normally don't wear my hair flat. Well, you can't even wear it flat unless you cut it like all the way down, but this is hilarious. Mateo actually did a pretty good job. It's a really nice fade. I'll probably do the hairline myself because Let's be honest, like, I could tell they were like, I don't know how to do that. But I will do the hairline myself, but 
pretty pretty damn good job they were hyping me up they had me cracking up they were saying oh we never have afro hair in here we love afro hair can i feel your hair i was like oh my gosh yes. they're like this is the best hair but they're like it must be hell trying to find a barber and i was like yeah okay i'm back mateo actually did a pretty good job i mean considering i'm sure it's his first time working with black hair so he did a pretty good pretty good job it was 24 euros so not too bad um back in the states i normally pay like 35 dollars for a haircut and then a five dollar tip so this was fine i look so greasy i've been riding public transport so that's why i'm so greasy but i'm gonna fix it up a little bit to make it a little bit more uh, what i'm used to and my hairline like I said earlier, I'm just gonna let my hairline grow out a little bit more. I don't want it to be that sharp anymore because it just doesn't last. And I need my hairline to grow forward instead of me pushing it back. But I'm gonna fix it a little bit so it's a little bit better. hair it will grow back well for some people but it will grow back and I can do it again but you know they were so nice and also if you have any other barbers or anybody else that you recommend in Milan let me know start a little conversation in the comment section if you're in other parts of Italy and you have afro hair or you're black Put your little stuff in the comments section so we can start kind of like a um, a resource for people to find good barbers that know how to do black hair. All right, I'll, I will talk to you soon. Until next time, ci vediamo.